boys as we honor our scouts Eric Belzo and Chris Frank for their ascent to the rank of Eagle Scout. This is indeed a special night in the lives of these scouts and this troop. Before we begin our program, I'd like to introduce a few special people. Mr. and Mrs. Velasi, Mr. Jay Popovitz, Mr. Barry, Mr. Burns, Mr. Frank Camarino, Mr. Trace, Mr. Chase Clubhand. I would like to remind you that there is a special reception honoring our new Eagle Scouts immediately following the ceremony. Now please rise for the invitation presented by Mr. Brian Murphy and remain standing for the presentation of the colors. Thank you very much, Mike. It's a pleasure to be here tonight. Do we have a great dad or do we have a great dad? If this was snow, we have like 47 inches of snow, so we are blessed to be here. All right. We thank you for bringing us to the, together as a family of scouts gathered to celebrate the accomplishments of Chris and Erica. Eric. All right. In the rank of Eagle. We ask you that you would bless these young men, their families, the scout leaders, guests, are assembled here. And finally, we ask for a continued guidance for all the scouts of Troop 617. Give our leaders, we pray, the patience and wisdom to guide each scout on life's pathway. We thank you for hearing our prayer tonight. We offer in the name of our Creator, our God. Amen. Having it, let you look anyone in his eye. 
liking it, he won't look back. Keep this one at the top of your list. Loyal. The very word is life itself. For without loyalty, we have no love of person or country. Helpful. Part sharing, part caring. By helping each other, we help ourselves. Not to mention mankind. Be always full of help. The dying man's last words. Friendly. Brotherhood is part of that word. You can take it in a lot of directions and go. Make sure and start with brotherhood. Courteous. Allow each person his human dignity, which means a lot more than saying, yes, ma'am, and thank you, sir, to reflect an attitude that later in life you wish you had honored more. Early in life, save yourself that problem. Do it now. Kind. This one word would stop wars and erase hatred. But it's like your bicycle is just no good unless you get out and use it. Obedience starts at home. Practice it with your parents, your family, and larger than your friends. Share it with honesty. Cheerful. Anyone can put a happy face on when the going is good. The secret is to wear it as a mask for your problems. It might surprise you how many others do the same thing. Thrifty means a lot more than putting pennies away, and it is the opposite of cheap. Common sense covers it just as about as well as anything. Brave. You don't have to fight to be brave. Millions of good, fine, decent folks show more bravery than any we chance just by getting out of bed every morning, going out to do a good day's work, and living the best life they know how against the law of odds. Clean. Soap and water help a lot on the outside, but it's the inside that counts, and don't ever forget it. Reverend. Leave in anything that you want to believe in. Keep God at the top of it. With Him, life can be a beautiful experience. Without Him, you're just fighting time. This is John Wayne. Over and up. I will now call on Mr. Frank and Mr. Delzo to present their vision of the Trail to Eagle Scout featuring. Mike and Herb's Outdoor Cooking Show in the Trail to Eagle. Too. All right. <laughs> 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 
the wood smoke around here. Anyway. <laughs> Need a couple of decks of the wheat blow. Okay. <coughs>
for obvious reasons. <laughs> so already you're pulling in a time traveler, a pirate, Santa, and Terraform. So last night I was watching um, uh, I was watching that show with Jeff Jeff Foxworthy, what's that called? Uh, Are you smarter than a fifth grader? Okay. And this kid, he might be twenty or so, he gets a question and says, If you're standing on the equator, what side will the sun rise from? And he's like, well, I'm an Eagle Scout, and I know it's either east or west. Well, it's got to be one or the other, right? So he, he, you know, figured it out. It was east. Um, and what, is, what does this mean, other than the fact that, yes, I was on a Friday night lying on the couch watching Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? Uh, but it's but that scouting has a profound impact on American culture. In, in, in fact, worldwide, scouting has constituted one of the most meaningful and worthwhile social movements in history. As, mo- as members of the Boy Scouts of America, you have contributed to the momentum of the scouting network and have played a significant role in its manifestation. Therefore, you've both been noted worthy of the Eagle Scout honor, and all who know you celebrate this achievement, and many are here to celebrate with you. Now this position, as you know well, is one of honor and responsibility. In fact, as new Eagle Scouts, you've assumed a solemn obligation to your duty to God, to your country, and to your fellow person. Now this is a great undertaking. Now, as you live up to your obligations, you have to continue to bring honor to this organization. And you have four key responsibilities. First, the major responsibility of an Eagle Scout is to live with honor. Uh, Scoutish trustworthy is the very, you know, is the first point of the Scout law for a reason. Living honorably reflects credit on his home, his church, his troop, and his community. And now may the white, may the white of the Eagle Scout badge represent, um, remind you that you should always live with honor. A second obligation of an Eagle Scout is to live with loyalty. A Scout is true to his family, his friends, his Scout leaders, his school, and his nation. And all of these help to build the loyalty that brings um, devotion to the community, to country, and to one's own ideals. So let the blue of the Eagle Badge always inspire you to be loyal. Third is that the Eagle Scout should be courageous. Courage has not always been a quality by which men measure themselves to others. To a Scout, bravery means not only the courage to face physical danger, but the determination to stand up for what is right. I mean, you don't have to be strong. Look at me. Um, pretty pathetic. But let the red and the eagle badge remind you to always have courage. And the final rep- uh, responsibility of an eagle scout is service. Now, the eagle scout extends a helping hand no matter what the situation calls for, and he's always there to aid and comfort the unfortunate and the oppressed. He upholds the rights of others while defending his own, and he will always be prepared to put forth his best. Yeah, you two deserve so much credit for having achieved scouting's highest award. But wear your award with humility, ever mindful that people will look at you as an example. Therefore, I charge you to undertake this award with solemn dedication. Live and serve that those who know you will be inspired to a finer life. I charge you to be among those who dedicate their skills and abilities to the common good. Today, I'm sure that you do not understand the full gravity of this award. Not yet. However, the role that it will play in their life will be significant be it from answering a question on a game show, or reaching out to those in need. The Eagle Scout Award is indicative that they have and will continue to improve, change, evolve, and make a difference in the lives of every person they encounter. The the Award of the Eagle Scout is just not something that we should celebrate for them today, but maybe they are a small glimpse of hope for the world of tomorrow.
the old covenant and redeem this God old. Now you will stand and repeat a new old, and the and the eagle shall promise. To the words to the to the words you say, uh, though the words you say are similar to those you said so many times before, tonight they will mean more to you than they ever have. When you pledge yourself on your sacred honor, you will be sealed. You will be sealing your oath with the words which close the, the Declaration of Independence. I would like your dads, who are both Eagle Scouts, to join you at this time and ded- rededicate themselves by repeating the Scout Promise with our new Eagle Scouts. All Eagle Scouts in the audience may also stand to recite the Eagle Promise. Please, please uh, make the Scout sign or be after me. I reaffirm my allegiance. I reaffirm my allegiance to the three promises of the Scout Oath. To the three promises of the Scout Oath. I thoughtfully recognize. I thoughtfully recognize. And take upon myself. And take upon myself. The obligations and responsibilities. The obligations and responsibilities. Of the Eagle Scout. Of the Eagle Scout. On my honor, I will do my best. On my honor, I will do my best. To make my training an example. My rank and my influence my rank and my influence count strongly for better scouting. Count strongly for better scouting. And for better citizenship. And for better citizenship. In my troop. In my troop. In my community. In my community. And in my contact with other people. And in my contact with other people. To this I pledge my sacred honor. To this I pledge my sacred honor. To Dad to be seated. I'm sure at this point you would like to invite some very special people to join you on this wonderful occasion. Would the honor guard please escort the candidate's parents to the stage? It is now time for the highlight of our program, the presentation of the Eagle Scout Awards. I'd like to ask Scoutmaster Pete Toussaint to make the appropriate presentations. Parents have undoubtedly been your primary source of help and strength. No wonder no one will ever know the unnumbered acts of self-sacrifice from your mothers. I'd like to invite your mothers right now to pin the Eagle Medal on your uniform. In recognition of your mother's devotion, please present the miniature eagle pin. 
que amamos. Troop 617 also has a small gift for your mothers. In return, please present your father to this eagle in his eagle. Certificate of Recognition of 